Thank you for joining me today in session four of Jury Duty 101. And so we're going to talk about today when uh, the jury is out in deliberation and when there are people, other jurors, talking about the case, deliberating, and you are listening to other jurors and what their perceptions are with the facts of the case, right? And what you're thinking is different than what other people are thinking. And so we have a tendency to think that if our thinking, our perspective is different than what other people are thinking, well, there's something wrong with us, right? We tend to kind of suppress that and not voice that. I'm going to share with you a scripture verse, and I'm going to put it on the screen, of Romans chapter 12, verse 2. And I'm going to share this verse in the King James Version first. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Now, we're going to look at the same verse in the uh, New Living Translation. Here's what it says. Don't copy the behavior and customs of this world, but let God transform you into a new person by changing the way you think. Then you will learn to know God's will for you which is good and pleasing and perfect. And so looking at that verse, two different translations, uh, the King James Version has, uh, and be not conformed to this world, okay? And I want us to center in on that word conformity. Conformity. I believe one of the biggest idols that we battle today is conformity. You know, when we read about the different idols in the Old Testament, we tend to think that they are statues relating to false religions. And so we think, well, you know, we don't have trouble with that. So we're okay, we don't have to worry about idols. But in today's society, you know, idols can be ideas, conformity, right? We have the tendency to want to conform to any situation that we're in, in any stage in life. And this really challenges us because we are losing our voice when we conform. Now, you know, God made us to be relational beings. Uh, that's, that's how we are, right? but not at the expense of not of, of losing our voice, of compromise. When we're in jury deliberation and our perspective is a different perspective, our voice is a different voice, we tend to suppress that because we want to conform to whatever group is around us. We don't want to stand out. And so, the two hardest words for us to say are the words, I disagree. You know, when we share our perspective, our lens on the case, and it's a different lens, you know, we are really bringing a new, fresh perspective to this case. And when we push past our fear of conformity and really share what's different than what everybody else has put on the table, you know, let's just see what comes from that. Are there people that are able to refute 
what you've brought to the table? Or is their response just trying to put pressure on you to not say anything, to stay silent? Because they want to be done with this court case and to move on with their life. They want, to be, they want to be done with jury duty. They're ready to get back home. They want to move on. And so, you know, let's really be courageous in sharing our perspective. Because, and keep doing it. If you can't get people to refute what you have done, what you are sharing, then you just may be onto something. You just may be the vessel used, being used to execute justice in this court case. So if our view is different, who cares? If other people don't get on board and to see it and they can't refute it, who cares? Keep standing your ground because it is much better to put forth your best effort and to stand your ground and to know that you have done the very best in this court case. And if it's a hung jury, it's a hung jury. If you can't get a unanimous decision, then it's a hung jury and you have a clear conscience you can sleep very good at night. And so let me encourage you to fight conformity and to say the words, I disagree. I can't wait to see you in the next class session. You can click on that video above.